Hey guys, it's Hogrex and welcome back to Toy Badge to play review. Another showcasing video after a long delay. I'm sorry for that uh, if uh, there was a long delay because I didn't really find any time to record this episode. But we are back and uh, looking for some more replays where, where you guys destroy you, go into pieces, and sometimes you do six tricking or six bar, which is also a really good thing. So, how are you guys doing? Everything is chilling, everything is golden, everything is hunky dory. Okay, so let's review the replay. The first replay here is sent by Sunha where he's doing a tricking replay where this is pretty sick replay, he got good flow and uh, let's look at in a little bit slow motion so he does a kind of a uh, spin. This kind of a spin I always wanted to do in real life but I couldn't really uh, like success, succeed in it. And then does a flip and a twist kind of and then at the end uh, um, Okay, punch like taps you into the into the back of the neck. Okay, pretty, pretty sick. So the next replay we have here is by Dirtman203 where he's fighting the Warfare, Infinity Warfare if I may say that game, Call of Duty Infinity Warfare. Okay, so here's this guy doing a spar with this guy and at the end I don't know what happened. Okay, he grabbed his neck and he's dead. Both of them are dead. I don't know why that happened, but that happened. Okay. So let's look into the replay in slow motion and see what is actually happening. So Dirtman, uh, the warfare goes for a run at first. Uh, Dirtman does some tricking at start uh, and uh, takes some damage uh, and uh, goes for uh, goes for a knee kick uh, on the head of warfare and at the end uh, grab this uh, his hand his arm uh, just like the Rock uh, in WWE and that was pretty sick. That was cool cooperation between you guys. Sick. Next replay we have here is a uh, uh, madman or the youth bashing replay by Zioli Zio, Ninja. Okay, so he goes for a wheel opener or something. Okay, and then uh, grabs you from the head and kick his specs and then kicks the uh, other arm and uh, breaks his wrist and I don't know, uh, uh, just just like sticks it to uh, Yuke's neck. Okay, that's, that's all it is. Next replay we have here is by Regatten where he has a pretty sick style actually to be honest. That style is pretty unique. So, so he relaxes his arms and then goes for a kick, a, a boom kick right into Yuke's abs. I don't know how he does such a, such sick damage but I like his style. It is pretty unique. So comes over here, spins and kicks Yuke's abs and splits him into half and then kicks the neck and peg parts and they all just fly away and at the end he just turns on the ground. He's pretty sick. Sick dude. Another play we have here is by Ash4136 where he is doing some spins at Yamin Yoko. That skeet was pretty sick and that actually was pretty sick. I don't know why I'm using that word a lot but this replay is sick. All of the replays are sick actually. So, okay, I like this pretty, this streak, pretty unique streak, so he streaks, I, I, I was supposed to pass him. So he streaks Yuke's head uh, right over here, and uh, he grabs it, and then when Yuke's uh, head uh, touches the ground, it, uh, it uh, decaps itself, so I think that was pretty sick. What do you guys say? That was sick? Yeah, that was sick for me, as t uh, for me at least. Next replay we have here is by Regatten as well where he does the same kind of a kick and uh, then uh, kicks uh, uh, Yuke into the peg parts and the torso and then decaps it. So a kick right to his abs, another kick right to his head and boom. There we go. And what are these f***ing notifications? Next replay we have here is by Gnaw where he's doing a spar with my Major where I I, I, I think Major is really sick at balancing and trying to stay on the ground on his feet and also does the damage to now we are now are here is uh, trying to defend trying to be defensive somewhat and also trying to be offensive but uh, more of a but over here major does more damage so that's what that's the actual point and then at the end he kicks uh, now into the head and he falls back on his back Next replay we have is by now where he's doing you bashing and taps you into the head and boom. Okay, <laughs> that was pretty sad. I don't know how did that happen, but uh, how he just uh, like destroyed his all oh, his torso by two, by his arms uh, by two grabs. Uh, that was pretty sick. So one thing I like about this is that uh, how he taps you into the head and then boom and then spreads him. <laughs> pretty funny. Okay, and then it takes his uh, this uh, kind of part uh, is lumbar. Yeah, that's lumbar. And then it grabs it from the arm and then it boop. Okay, there we go. So he just uh, destroys you over there, decaps him and all that stuff. By the way, grab DMs are not really that uh, cool in you bashing, so maybe you should not do grab DMs. But yeah, it's sick, it's sick. Next replay we have is by Rizzi where he's doing mad madman or you bashing kind of uh, 
So goes for punches and a kick into this in the start. Let's wait for the replay to load over. So obviously we see it in slow motion. So he he goes for a spin and then a kick right into his uh, split. So by keeping his flow, which is also a uh, point, which also a thing to notice here, is uh, keeping his flow and then goes for punches. First off, he goes. I don't know what I'm saying over here. Just pardon me. First off, he goes for a spin and then a kick. Ryuk right into his abs and a split set. Okay, that's cool. And then, then does a really sick punch into his head that it just begs, but these pegs just break. And then another punch into the peg, and then another punch into the head. So, yep, that's how it is, guys. I love how there is also only DMing and no like tricking or spinning kind of just one spin at the start and then just DMing you and then just lies on the ground. Sick. Next replay we have over here is by Daniel Pyers where he's doing a spar with uh, the 124. Oh wow, that, that was pretty that was pretty random over here, that kind of a scream, that uh, sound effect. But anyways, they both are doing pretty sick. Oh, that was sick pose, man. That is sick pose. I wish I could do that. But yeah, okay, so they go for some kind of tricking at the start. Okay, and then um, Daniel does some damage at the start. Okay. Well, I'm trying to be defensive. Good thing. Good shit. Good shit. Okay. And then kick around his head and he didn't take it. You should have taken that kick, uh, the one, two, four. Okay. And, um, all right. Everything's going good. And I like this uh, kind of uh, um, move that they both pulled out there. And this, uh, this kind of, uh, um, I don't know, um, roll, yeah, rolling of the 124 on the ground when Daniel Pius jumped over his body. As was sick, and then uh, Daniel knees him on the ground, on the head, and then he falls to the ground. Yep, and that pose is pretty sick. Next replay we have over here is by Beer Room, where he's in a spa with Mason. Do it! <laughs> Alright, so one thing about, I like about this uh, spa is let's go to the back, and uh, how they like uh, how Beer Room kicked. Uh, his opponent uh, into the head and then they flew back which is kind of good that was good impact but Mason didn't really like uh, show any like impact kind of like you should have fallen to the ground man hey come on now if someone kicks you in the head in real life you would have done like fall you would you just fall on the ground nothing else you can do about it so that you should do on Tori Bash as well it's a really six spot kind of but it's not really necessary but you know what I mean okay so, Bearum is doing some kicks, punches, punches with the A, and there we go, okay, so this fire is all right, yeah. You should have extended the frames or something, I don't know, that's just pretty chill, I just only like that uh, first kick on the head, that's why I take her in the replay, nothing else about it, I think it's normal. Next replay we have over here is by Miyoxi, where he does uh, some uh, sick spinning on the ground, and then kicks uh, Yuke's head and also loses his leg. No, kicks Yuke's head and loses his head, is kicks Yuke's head and loses his leg yeah that's what i'm trying to say god damn all right so he goes for a spinner at the start uh, kind of just falls on the ground at first and then um, kisses his abs uh, and then uh, goes for some kind of a manip kind of a manip small manip okay and then uh, kicks uh, yukes uh, into the head and then also loses his leg that was really sick i mean i know I, he lost his leg but come on now that yeah, was pretty sick that was creative Next replay we have over here is by Sun Javier. He is still doing that tricking. Okay. So, yeah, guys, this was the replay review of Tory Bash for this week. I hope you guys would have enjoyed it. If you guys have any sick or amazing replays, then send it right over there into the link in the description. That will lead you to a thread of mine and you will post a replay over there. Alright, so that that's clear. Okay, that should be clear. Like, if you are a Tory Bash, you should know how to send a replay. Like, come on. But yeah, hope you guys have enjoyed this episode and I will see you guys in my next episode or in the next video if I upload any other video in Tori Bash. So bye bye!